This session gives a brief introduction about introduction to image processing. To start with, let us look into the meaning of the term image processing. It is a process of transforming an image into its digital form and performing certain operations to get some useful information from it. The input image can be of any form. Such images need to be processed so that it is easy for analyzing. So image processing is the process or the methods used to transform an image into its digital form. Upon you get the image in digital form, it is easy to perform certain operations so that we get some useful information from the image. Now, why do we think the image processing is important? There are various list reasons that can be listed to prove that image processing is important. Few of the reasons are, it is always necessary that we enhance the pictorial representation so that you get a better human perception of the image. Image processing tools help us in improving the pictorial representation or enhance the image so that you get a better perception of the image. Image processing also is important in industrial applications for automation of various machine application. Thirdly, it is also necessary to process an image for efficient storage and transmission of the image. For example, if we want to store an image, it occupies certain space in memory. We process the image so that the amount of memory space occupied by the image is reduced. So these are the few of the reasons that is listed here to prove to show that image processing is very important. Now, looking into the term image, what is an image? We can define an image as a two-dimensional function f of x, y where x and y are spatial coordinates and the amplitude of f at any point or any coordinate x, y, we call it as the intensity or the gray level of the image at that particular point. When x and y and the intensity values of f, all of these are finite discrete quantities, we call such an image as a digital image. So a digital image consists of intensity values of the image at each coordinate position x, y. A digital image is composed of finite number of elements. Each of these elements has its own location and the value associated with it. The location we call it in terms of the coordinate position x, y and the value we call it as the intensity value or the gray level value. These elements we call it as the picture elements or image elements or pels and or pixels. Pixel is a common term used to denote the elements of a digital image. Hence, throughout this session, we will be using the term pixel to denote the element of a digital image. Now to give a brief introduction on the origin of image processing techniques. One of the earliest application of digital images was in newspaper industry. It was necessary that pictures has to be sent from one place to another. So they used submarine cable to send pictures across London and New York. Now Bartlin cable picture transmission was introduced in the year 1920 which reduced the time required to transport the image across Atlantic. It reduced the time from uh, which was required earlier around a week. The Bartlin cable system reduced it to around three hours. The early Bartlin system were capable of coding images in five distinct levels of gray. Later on, this capability was increased to 15 levels in the year by the year 1929. Digital image processing techniques began in the late 1960s and early 1970s. And these processes or these techniques of Im improving the image quality or enhancing the image quality or processing the images were greatly used in the field of medical imaging, remote earth resources observation and in the field of astronomy. 
in 1970s early 1970s ct scan images were used for analysis in the medical domain and it is one of the most important event in the application of image processing in medical diagnosis from 1960s until present the field of image processing has grown vigorously in addition to applications in medicine and the space program digital image processing techniques are used in broad range of various other applications now various computer procedures or computer algorithms are used to enhance the intensity levels of every image this can be used both in gray level images or gray gray images as well as in color images now uh, computer procedures can be used to enhance the contrast or in the intensity levels for easier interpretation basically used in x rays to detect various uh, observations like the spread of pneumonia the level of pneumonia etc it can be used in other images also in the field of in various industries like medicine and biologic biological sciences we could also see geographers use the same techniques to study pollution patterns from aerial or satellite imagery image enhancement and restoration procedures are used to process the degraded images of unrecoverable objects in archaeology image processing methods have successfully restored blurred pictures that were only available records of rare artifacts or damaged images after being photographed there are successful applications of image processing concept that is found in astronomy biology nuclear medicine law enforcement defense and various other industries that's all for this session next session we will look into the applications of image processing